the other, but that's why they call this a handicap match. Ready to get this started, we see Cody Rhodes, and they are about to test the numbers game with Roman Reigns, Solo Sokoa, and Jimmy Uso. The odds firmly stacked on one side of this deck here. I'm curious to see how it plays out as this match progresses. Springboard off, fishing for something beneath the ring. Oh, 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 oh. foot, meet face. Oh, no. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. What's Reigns about to manufacture? You're a Nagi. Man, oh, man. He is looking to do some serious harm. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. He grabbed the chair. Uh, now would be a good time to run. Looks like they do not want them inside the ring anymore. Time to venture outside the ropes. Oh, man. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. I'm sure it's as easy as it sounds, but Corey, how do you approach a handicap match when you're coming in with the numbers advantage? Honestly, Cole, I'd be looking for a quick finish. The more time you waste needlessly beating down your opponent or even showboating, the more opportunities you're creating for the rug to get pulled out right from under you. Reigns plans in motion. From the top, top and down. He's taking some good hits. Reversal, what a counter. Reigns cuts him off. Big clothesline. Uh-oh. Knew what Roman had coming. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. He's going for it all. From... Figure four leg lock applied. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. From behind, back suplex. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, the longer this handicap match goes, it seems the more damage they're going to have to endure. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. And he slides him back to the mat. Reversal! Can he take advantage? And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Brilliant countering by both competitors. The big dog had that scouted. Just from a deadlift position. Sit out, Powerbomb. Crushing impact corner. And a couple back elbows to follow. Oh, man. Roman Reigns with a couple of headbutts, follows by a right hand, and Reigns has him right where he wants him. Steps outside the ring. This here, classic Roman Reigns measuring his man. Drive by. Roman dealing with Cody as he has so many others with disdain. Reigns in the corner, ready to strike. Spin! What impact! Reigns put his stamp on this one. Jeopardy for Rhodes. Cover! Two! He! No way! No way! Cody Rhodes.
Rhodes with a defiant kick out, simply refusing to stay down. And after all that, Roman Reigns still has an end to this battle. Just disrespectful. And Cody's resolve might be wavering here. Reigns isn't giving Cody any breathing room. his opponent how confident he is he needs to be prepared spiked with a urinagi and more attacks to his core could hinder his offense what a headline vicious roman being the aggressor reigns is making an opportunity for himself big elbow drop continues to focus on that region of the body surely is pinpointing that spot and finds a counter. But Cody has to push now while the window's open. Using the ropes. And a big oh. boot. Oh, oh, man. Look at this. Just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Incoming. Nasty kick. Just disrespectful. We might need medical personnel out here very soon. Yeah, I agree with you. The referee can only diagnose so much. Oh. Spear by Reigns. Wow, Reigns nailed it. Reigns hits it. Yet another big move, guys. Looking for the victory. Two. Solo Sokoa, Jimmy Uso, and Roman Reigns, the Bloodline. And if you're getting a victory like that, you got to be feeling pretty good about yourself. This one felt special from the moment the bell rang. We knew it was going to be a show. He had really lived up to all the expectations.